hello. <laughs> I'm going to do another soap today. <coughs> Excuse me. I have gloves now, but Natalie and I went to buy bits and pieces from the wholesaler yesterday, and we bought these in a size small. <laughs> So we can't get them on. Well, kind of can get them on, but they really, like, they just aren't any good. So I've got to use my yellow, my yellow gloves, which I hate using to make soap, but we'll have a go. I prefer that than uh, getting soap all over my hands. So, just going to pour my lye into my oils. Today's soap will be quite a masculine scent. It's a Valentine's one, but this one's more of a fresh sort of green type of a scent with some lavender oil, some bergamot oil, and some geranium oil. So it's already nice and fresh, but I've added a fragrance to it as well, which is just so gorgeous. It's really, really sort of like a masculine, cool type of... Mm, it's like a cedar, it's like cedar in there, and also fragrant hints of bergamot and geranium, so we'll see. It does smell really good, this blend, I've just uh, poured it off. Yeah, it's nice and rich and like, um, like a fresh, clean, manly scent, so buy one for your boys. <laughs> I'm just going to do like a two colour soap, I'm going to do like a sort of darkish green base with a lighter green swirl inside it so it's nice and fresh for Valentine's and spring. Oh I haven't got that thing, I don't need one today. Okay, I'm just going to whiz this up. as well with a light green base that'll be a bit nicer I think. So for my dark green I should get a spoon. I'm going to use some chlorella powder. It does fade a little bit, but I really, really like this, so I'm going to give it a go again. I've got to get some more of it actually, I mean, almost out. So it's a good colour. It's natural, it's like an algae. So it looks like a khaki green when you first start to use it, and then when it, <coughs> sorry, <coughs> when it reacts, and saponifies, the next day you'll get like a really fresh, vibrant green. Okay, and then the other one I'm going to use is alfalfa powder. And get it open. Mm -hmm. Get my off a second. Turn the radio down a little bit. Sorry. Okay, I'm going 
use quite a bit of this to get a nice head of green. you can see what I'm doing over here. Okay, it shouldn't move. I have done a water discount but I read the notes and it shouldn't accelerate. Trace. So let's hope it doesn't. Yeah, that's fine. Oh god that does smell good. It's like a really fresh, clean, manly smell. So like when your chucks just come out of the bath or something. Or <laughs> out well, the shower, it's got that really good, like, oh, really nice and fresh and clean. Lovely. Lovely. Tripods decided to go a bit AWOL. There we go. Okay. Start pouring then. Before I can move that. It's a bit thicker, but we'll cope with that. Sorry, just get a chopstick. Some movement in there again. Just moving moved a little bit fast because I've done such a discount on there. But it's still nice to use. Nice um to soap, sorry. Men are gonna love this. I don't usually do many manly soaps because most of the customers are women really, but Although we do have quite a few men customers, there's not that many, but this is a this is really nice. So for the male customers out there, you will love it. It's really nice. Hmm. 
quite citrusy. See properly, and then let's do some spoonage. Need to do too much there. It's got to work a bit faster than usual really thickening up underneath, I can really feel it on the back of this spoon. But it ain't nothing we can't handle. Okie dokie. Now, I'm going to Give this a little sprinkle of something. Uh, what shall I use? A bit of parsley leaf, I think, because that's a nice vibrant green and it doesn't really go brown. Parsley! Here we go. Parsley leaf in, in soap as well, it's really good. So, that green underneath, that like sort of darker shade you can see, will go like a really nice, vibrant sort of grass green. One more soap to make for Valentine's, which will be another foodie scent with some marshmallow cones and like a cinnamon type, cinnamon drum, like cinnamon roll type scent, and then something extra special to go in. But I ain't gonna say what it is. Okay, so this one is the male soap for the male. My male valentine soap. I don't know what I'm going to call it yet, but there you go. There it is. And I will see you for the cut tomorrow. Okay, bye.